We are starting with breaking news tonight. A shooting in Humboldt Park this evening. One police officer is shot and another is injured. WGN's Andrea Medina has been on the scene and now at the hospital. She joins us with this breaking news. Andrea. Jen and Ray, right now a significant police presence surrounds Stroger Hospital. You can see blue flashing lights in the background. We are waiting for police to give us an update into what happened and of course to learn a little bit more about how that officer who was shot is doing. Now in the meantime, take a listen to some police radio traffic that reveals the intense moments when gunfire erupted. That chaos unfolded around 6 p.m. near West Fernandez Street and North Avers Avenue. At least two vehicles were riddled with bullet holes. A white SUV could be seen with the back passenger side window shot out, and the gray SUV also has multiple bullet holes in the windshield. It's not known who fired the shots first or how many shots were fired. Police blocked off the area as part of their investigation, laying down several evidence markers. Fire officials say an officer was shot and taken to Stroger Hospital with not running injuries. Another officer was also taken to Stroger with a minor medical issue. A suspect was shot and taken to Mount Sinai in critical condition. Now, a short time ago, the mayor stopped by the hospital to check in on the officer who was hurt. The, the Civilian Office of Police Accountability, or COPA for short, is investigating this officer and involved shooting. Now, once again, we are waiting for police to give us an update any minute now into what unfolded earlier today. We're live outside Stroger Hospital. Andrea Medina, WGN News. Right. We'll go to that when that happens. Thank you very much, Andrea.